Gemini. Mm mm. Gemini. Mm mm. Gemini. Mm mm. <laughs> Hello, Gemini. Welcome back. This is an all sign bonus reading. So towards the end, I will be going from Aries to Pisces, pulling some channel messages to see what they would want you to know at this point in time, okay? As I said, this is a general reading. So keep an open mind. Take what only you feel feels, feel feels, you feel uh, makes sense for your situation at this present time. Please like, share this video, subscribe, my loves. I really appreciate it. So let's see what we have for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Overall energy here. King of Wands starting off, okay? Showing his face here. So this King of Wands, male or female, doesn't matter. You may have someone who, who wants you pretty bad here. Someone wants the other person pretty bad. Very passionate about the person, right? Let's see. Some of you can have a King of Pentacles. So Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or a Taurus, or a Libra, or a Cancer. All right, let's see what we got. King of Wands is the overall energy. What did my daughter do to my little Christmas thing? All right. What is coming to Gemini in love? Gemini, please. What is coming to Gemini in love, angels? Gemini. Gemini. What is coming to Gemini in love? Gemini. Well, I knew that King of Wands would show up, guys. Some of you have someone who walked away from you, or maybe you walked away from coming back towards you. Okay? You got the King of Wands. Someone really, really wants to return to you. Or for some of you, maybe this person really, really wants you to come back to them. Okay? But someone's thinking about a, a passionate new start beginning with you. Now, because it's Wands, we know they want to have something passionate with you again. But let's see what else this freak may want <laughs> what is coming to gemini and love gemini okay wow um what is coming to gemini and love gemini gemini i feel like someone still wants you gemini okay um you have the five of cups some of you are kind of disappointed in this person Maybe that's why you walked away or you're disappointed in the situation. You you know, there was some kind of loss here or feelings of a loss here, uh, whether on your end or this person's end, okay? But somebody is really wanting to reconcile with you, Gemini. You have Six of Cups, Ace of Wands. Reconciliation starter pack. What is coming to Gemini in love, Gemini? So you have someone who's really wanting to come after you. What is coming to Gemini in love, Gemini? Someone really, really wants to connect with you. Wow. We have the two of cups. Mm. All right, Gemini. What else do we have for the Gemini, please, in love? I do feel like, Gemini, this is a soulmate, okay? Um, this is someone that you've shared, you know, a very close connection with, um, okay? And I feel like you guys connect very well with each other, even if, let's say, this was never someone that you actually dated romantically. This could be um, a friend, okay, that you had a lot of good chemistry with. And, you know, uh, it seemed like you guys really hit it off in the past, okay? What's coming to Gemini in love? Now you have the king and the queen of wands. Um, you guys are quite the pair, okay? Or you guys could have been quite the pair. <laughs> so uh, you have judgment reverse. I feel like... Um, Gemini, somebody in this situation may have made a poor judgment or a poor decision here. Maybe they left for someone else. I hate to say stuff like that, but maybe they left for someone else or, you know, they just decided not to pursue a relationship with you for XYZ reason. But, you know, there was some type of disappointment here. And Gemini, this person is having a lot of uh, regret. Okay, they do. They feel as though they missed out on this, Gemini, okay? Um, so this is why they're coming back all passionate here. So you could very well be dealing with a Sagittarius, okay? Um, Aries or Leo, okay? We also have Scorpio here. We have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy and fire energy. So this may be someone who could have a lot of fire in their chart or maybe a lot of water, okay? Um, but 
this is what they're about to do, Gemini, okay? They're about to start up a fire with you. <laughs> they're coming back into your life here. Um, some of you, don't be surprised if, you know, they don't come empty-handed. They may bring you something as a token of their sorry or whatever it is, okay? But I think this person recognizes now that you and them really shared something special. You know, you and them just were amazing together. I mean, the king and the queen of wands, that's, that's a dynamic pair here, Gem, okay? Um, the attraction never went anywhere, Gemini, okay? So this could be an, an X is what I'm hearing, but someone's coming back or they really want to come back, okay? Or someone really wants the other person to come back. Now, this person could be long distance. They could show up at your door, okay? They could travel to you, want to see you, okay? I feel like this is someone who wants to do better. They want to do better, be better. Some of you, I'm hearing that this is someone that you were uh, working with, a coworker or something like that. Okay, but there was some type of walking away here or, you know, where someone wasn't really happy or satisfied maybe with the way things were going or it's a general reading, guys. I can't tell all 25,000 of you, you know, it was this one situation. No, you guys all went through different uh, variations of this story, but the whole point, the whole, as a whole, you guys are more than likely dealing with a situation to where either you had to walk away, they had to walk away, okay? Um, you have the Six of Cups. That's what they want, Gem, okay? They want to come back. Once again, Eight of Cups reverse. Someone made a poor decision about walking away from you and they regret walking away from you. Um, or maybe you regret walking away from this person, Gemini, okay? Um, or letting you walk away. Some of you I'm hearing, maybe you were the one who got away, okay? What's the Five of Cups for Gemini? Five of Cups, please. Yeah, I'm hearing some, that song by um, Katy Perry. The one who got away. Someone missed out on love with you. Somebody missed out on love, Gemini. That's what happened. Somebody missed out on love. Wow, the one that got away. Ain't that something? Somebody missed out on a soulmate, a beautiful life with someone, potential to have a beautiful life, you know, that's what they missed out on. So now they're going to come back, you know, and they hope that they can still have that opportunity with you, Gemini, okay? So I'm hearing this was a friend, okay, who maybe at the time they didn't want to be more than friends, now they do, okay? You guys are soulmates, you have a past life connection with this person, Gemini. Six of Cups, Two of Cups, that's double confirmation. Tell me about this judgment reverse. What poor decision did this person make? Gemini for Gemini. Judgment reverse. The sun reverse. Some of them, they were very childish in the past, okay? Or maybe they just didn't know what they wanted, okay? There was a lack of clarity here, okay? Okay, or they just wanted to be friends, like I said. Mm-hmm. Something maybe probably was wrong with this person's mindset. Maybe they wanted to play the field. They wanted to be free, okay? Look, I can see different scenarios from these cards, okay? But understand, the moral of the story is whoever walked away here will be returning. <laughs> and uh, they really regret walking away, Gemini, okay? Here's what they're about to do. Now, tell me about the temperance card. Yeah, you guys are gonna uh, restore your connection, whether that be as lovers or friends. But I feel like it's more romantic. They wanna restore their connection with you as um, lovers, Okay, this could be a Taurus. This is what they want to do. Um, I'm hearing that they have an idea as well. So say, for instance, this was an ex and maybe they want to, you know, get the spark back with you again and um, work on the relationship with you. They can propose traveling, going out of town with you. Um, Gemini is what I'm hearing. So tell me more for Gemini, please. Gemini in love. What is coming to Gemini in this situation? Ooh. wow once again this freak made a poor judgment gemini they had their hand on their head okay they made a poor judgment like i was already saying okay and now here they come they're ready to release a love block gemini mm -hmm. road to recovery uh-huh love drop there they need your love i need your love <laughs> I need your love. This soul bond is sacred. 
All right, and then you have a waiting for this union and no ordinary love. So this person knows there is no ordinary love. Some of you, yeah, um, if you believe in twin flame, twin flame connection here. We have twin flame union approaching, okay? So just understand, yeah, this person's, you know, not coming in just to screw with you. But let's see what this person really wants from you. So what does this person really desire with Gemini, please? What does this person really desire with Gemini? justice queen of cups the world king of coins seven of cups what does this person really desire with gemini what does this person really desire the sun bottom of the deck is the lovers this person desires to have a relationship with you gemini now it's up to you, could be a cancer, but this person wants some wants to start over. They probably want to show you that they can be that person for you, that king of pentacles, the person you can rely on, the person you can put your, your head on their shoulder. Okay, the person that will care for you, love you, be there for you, um, you know, protect and provide. I feel like, you know, even if this is a woman, it doesn't matter, you know, this person wants to show you that they can be loyal to you. They can, you know, or whatever the case may be. They want to ease your fears, ease your worries. That's what they want, Gemini. So they do appear to have good intentions, even if they're coming in very passionate. Um, it's a good passion that they have for you, okay? Their heart is beating for you again, Gemini. Their heart is going, but a boom, but a boom, but a boom, 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 boom. Okay, let me. <laughs> oh boy, you have fate. This is a destined partnership. Mm hmm, Gemini. Yep, yep, yep. Maybe after some distance, you know, this person has clarity now what they really want here okay yep all right and then you have trust it is safe to trust in this situation one more okay well we have spiritual lessons this person is in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson so perhaps this person learned you know their spiritual lessons okay and uh so being separated from you is not what they want to keep doing okay that's just point blank period All right, so let's get into. Let's see, sorry about that, guys. All right. Gemini, if you are dealing with an Aries, let's see what Aries wants to tell Gemini, please. Aries to Gemini. All right. So this Aries says, I'm sorry. Maybe this Aries in the past wasn't ready to settle down, but now they're crushing on you pretty hard. They want to know if you can meet up. Ooh, see that? Oh, I got that as confirmation. Aries came out. <laughs> Ooh, that's confirmation. They get butterflies when you talk. These Aries can have cancer in their charts. And they're feeling pretty possessive over you right now, Aries, uh, Gemini. Sorry about that, okay? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. All right. For those of you dealing with a Taurus, let's see. What does Taurus want to communicate to Gemini? Taurus to Gemini, Spirit. Taurus to Gemini. So this Taurus was hiding their true feelings for you, Gem. And that's not what they want to keep doing. They say that they... Nope, that's not it. They say that they were wrong. Okay? I was wrong. Yep. Um, you have let's get married. What does this Taurus want to tell Gemini? Um, maybe this Taurus was a coward in the past. They were afraid of your connection. You have tell them your mind. Okay? Taurus to Gemini. What do we have? They say, please take me back, baby. Please. I'm begging you. Okay. Um, some of you, this Taurus put you in the friend zone and they regret that. Okay. And now they're saying that they love you. Bottom of the deck, we have, I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, that's what we got. That's what we got. If you're dealing with another Gemini... What does Gemini want to tell Gemini? 
trust issues. Some of them let trust issues get in the way. Confirmation, Gemini. You have illusions in the reverse. So this person had illusions and trust was scaring them from you, Gemini. Okay, they're trust issues. You have fake calls. So this uh, Gemini is calling you fake numbers and they say that they won't hurt you. Okay, they have plans to ask you out. All right, what else? Gemini to Gemini. Some of them, they were still immature, maybe even emotionally. They needed to grow up, but they cannot move on, okay? That's what we have for that Gemini to you. All right. So if you're dealing with a Cancer, what does Cancer want to communicate to Gemini, please? Wow. So this cancer is spying on you through tarot readings. They're getting tarot readings or they're watching me, right? <laughs> um, some of these cancers, maybe they wanted to play the field in the past, okay? That's not what they want now. Missing you is driving me crazy. This cancer is very, very obsessed with you. Cancer to Gemini. Cancer to Gemini. Maybe this cancer had deep-seated issues that they needed to work through, which was making them unsure, okay? Cancer to Gemini. They get butterflies when you talk. Okay. You have plans to propose. Okay. Bottom of the deck, you have fake calls. So this cancer is probably calling you with fake numbers. And I also seen trust issues. So this cancer probably had a great deal of trust issues. Okay. All right. If you're connected to a Leo. All right. Let's see. Leo to Gemini. What does Leo want to tell Gemini? Okay, so you have only want to hook up in the reverse. So this Leo only wanted to hook up in the past, okay? But that's not what they want anymore. Some of them, maybe they felt you were out of their league, okay? But you're the first thing on their mind in the morning. They're about to reach out, okay? Um, you have, I left them. So maybe they left a third party or left somebody else. Yeah, starting a relationship and heart cold, still mad at me. So, yeah. So we have for that Leo, guys, okay? If you're dealing with a Virgo, what does Virgo want to tell uh, Gemini? Virgo to Gemini. Ooh, so this Virgo says the grass was not greener, Okay person may have thought the grass is greener okay maybe they friend zone you this virgo could have libra in their chart virgo to uh gemini this virgo is probably playing mind games so this virgo probably was a liar and a cheater okay yeah my heart and my soul belongs to you this virgo could have libra libra in their chart or maybe there was a libra or a Leo involved, they have Leo in their chart, typing and deleting messages. This Virgo is watching your every move now. All right. If you are connected to a Libra, Libra to Gemini, please. Well, this Libra says their life is a disaster because they're dying to hear from you. <laughs> this Libra has been dreaming about you. You have time to heal. Let's see. What does Libra want to tell their Gemini, please? Taurus. So this Libra could have Taurus in their charts, okay? And they say, let's start over. Some of you, this Libra had abandonment issues. They left you before you left them. But they want to be more than friends now, okay? That's what they want to do. All right, if you are dealing with a Scorpio, Scorpio to Gemini, please. So the Scorpio says trying to leave them is in the reverse. So maybe this Scorpio finally left somebody, okay? Missing you is driving them crazy. They've been catfishing, maybe creating fake profiles to watch you and so forth, okay? You have I won't hurt you, Scorpio to Gemini. 
the Scorpio says that you are beautiful and they say they can't move on the Scorpio was non-committal in the past but look what comes after that they regret being non-committal snooze you lose you snooze you lose yep you snooze you keep losing Alrighty then, Sagittarius. What does Sagittarius want to tell Gemini? You have moved on. So maybe the Sag is worried that you've moved on or the Sagittarius has been trying to move on, okay? Uh, maybe they were playing games for uh, with you. For some of you, I'm hearing that they left for somebody else and maybe they regret doing that, okay? They're about to pursue you, Sagittarius to Gemini. Please be patient with me. Oh, you see, I, they say I left them. Okay. You have wine and dine. And then you have dying to hear from you. Divorce. So maybe they needed to finally get a divorce from someone. They could be telling you that they got a divorce. Okay. Oh, did I forget to put? <sighs> All right, so if you're dealing with a Capricorn, does Capricorn want to tell Gemini? Uh, this Capricorn felt like you deserve better than them in the past. Maybe they know you do. They're trying to find the right words to say to you. They say, will you marry me? Maybe this Capricorn was living a double life. Okay, for some you, this Capricorn has some childhood traumas going on. Maybe they couldn't be vulnerable, but now they want to be. Capricorn's a Gemini. All right, so what else do we have? This Capricorn can have Scorpio in their charts. You have Gemini. Okay, let me get one more. And now they're depressed, okay, without you. If you're dealing with a an Aquarius, sorry. Let's see what Aquarius wants to tell Gemini, please. Aquarius to Gemini. All right, you have my heart and soul belongs to you. I'm not ready to change is in the reverse, okay? So now they are. <laughs> they said they do want to be more than friends with you. Plans to ask you out. You have I love you, okay? Um, what was that? Something just showed up here. Okay, so this Aquarius could have Libra in their chart. I was seeing Libra, okay? Um, what does Aquarius want to tell Gemini? Aquarius to Gemini, please. I won't hurt you. Maybe this uh, Aquarius thought that they were just infatuated, but they're realizing it's actually the real deal here. Okay, they could have been emotionally unavailable. All right, so what else do we have? So, why is that? I've seen um, you're the best that I've ever had. Yep, coming out here. So, best I ever had. That's how this Aquarius feels, okay? All right. Hold on, let me see this real quick. All right, so if you are dealing with a Pisces, what does Pisces want to tell Gemini? Well, that flew out. We have about to pursue you. This Pisces could have cancer in their chart. They say, tell them you are mine. They could have Libra in their charts. Maybe this Pisces was back and forth and unsure. Okay. Pisces to Gemini. Only one to hook up is in the reverse. Okay. Aries. They say, let's get married. Some of you, they needed to leave a third party. Okay. And you have can't be vulnerable is in the reverse.
All right. So overall, let's see what this person wants to communicate. What does this person want to communicate to Gemini in this reading? Wow. Well, this person says, I love you. And I'm not ready to change this in the reverse. So now they are ready to change, guys. They say, I won't hurt you. Let's be more than friends. Okay. They say, my heart and soul belongs to you, Gemini. Yes, it does. Could be a Sagittarius. They were afraid to love, but this came out in the reverse. Okay. Now they don't want to be afraid to love. They were hiding their true feelings. Yeah, in the past, you probably were, you know, wasting your time with this person. Let's start over. I wonder what you think about me. I think this person has been trying to figure out what to say to you, how to come back. They've been needing to get the courage to come back to you. Some of them, they thought the grass was greener, okay? But uh, yeah, this freak sees the errors of their ways. And this card kept coming out. So there may be something about this freak putting you in the friend zone. Okay. Um, so, yeah, that's what we got, Jeff. Okay. All righty, my loves. Well, that is what, that's all she wrote. Hope you guys enjoyed this reading and it gave you clarity as to what you can expect to happen next in your love life. Okay, I love you guys. Yeah, it is strongly showing a reconciliation, guys. This is someone that you already know. Okay, I love you all. Talk to oh, actually, I didn't even, I don't even think I did a uh, huh. Well, 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 well. That's what they want, Jim. This is what they want. <laughs> this is exactly what they want. You know, they made a poor decision. They they regret their choice to put you in the friend zone, to leave you, or whatever the hell it was that they did, Jim. They regret that. Okay. So I love you all, and I will talk to you guys soon.